In addition to ground reaction forces, two other variables that are of interest within sport and exercise can be obtained from the force plate. These are the center of pressure and the free moment. The center of pressure is the location of the resultant ground reaction force vector in relation to the center of the force plate. The specific location of the center of pressure is provided by AX and AY, which are its coordinates along the X and Y axes of the plate. This example shows the path of the center of pressure in relation to the position of the foot during heel-toe running. The center of pressure is often used to assess balance, as shown here. By plotting AY against AX, this graph shows how the center of pressure shifts on the surface of the plate during a one-legged balance task. Transference of weight can also be estimated by observing changes in the center of pressure. By plotting AY against time, this graph shows how the weight of the golfer shifts from his right to his left foot during the swing. AY becomes negative as the center of pressure moves across the center of the plate. The free moment is the reaction moment to that applied to the force plate about a vertical axis through the center of pressure. This example shows the free moment during a twisting vertical jump. The free moment has negative and positive phases in reaction to the performer applying moments in clockwise and anticlockwise directions. In summary, in addition to the components of ground reaction force, the center of pressure and the free moment can also be obtained from force plate data. The center of pressure is the location of the resultant ground reaction force vector. Amongst other applications, it can be used to assess balance and the transference of weight. The free moment is the moment about a vertical axis through the center of pressure and can be used in the investigation of movements that involve twisting about a vertical axis.